Hi, now we'll see how to work with credentials concept. Credentials means username and password. We are going to create credentials in system manager. Observe this credentials in system manager under the securities we have credential concept. Here we need to create a credentials. See this here new option is the right, but before that, remember one thing. If you want to create a credentials, always you should have credential key for every Blue Prism environment. You should have one credential key. That credential key we are going to create in inscription scheme here. Observe this. Now let's give some value, any value, and then it will be saved in a database. When generate a key option is the right, when you click on this, it's generated a key observe this it's a so unique random number it has been generated this key it will be saved in database right if you create a credential key now the status observe so this is unavailable it is showing okay let it be okay when you created a this key then only it will create it in a database then only you can able to work with a credentials otherwise you cannot able to work with credentials. Now the key, it, it has been generated and it has been saved in our data phase, database default inscription scheme that will be remaining everything will be the same. No need to touch anything here. Okay. Now let's observe this, how to create a credential key. Come to the credential and then click on a new. Observe this, I will give the name CRED for example. So credentials means nothing but username and password. See this? We'll give then password. We'll give something. Okay. So you can give the expiry also. And we have given a credentials, but what is the advantage of this? Now come to this access rights. Now you came to know. See this security roles for which person you can give access to this. For which process you can able to give the access? For which resource you are going to give the access? Let's say select all the resources, select all, but when it is coming to the process, I selected only for environmental variable. See this selected only for environmental variable. It means whatever the credentials we have created, it is accessible and it is usable only in this environmental variable process other than this in any process you cannot able to use that so that is the advantage of credentials it's more secured when it is coming to username and password so it is more secured now this one when anyone if they want to use credentials is internal business object internal business object we have to use that ibo and then we have to use this username and password from the system manager understand in next session we'll see how to work with 